I got my hair cut today and it feels amazing. It is so soft. I am so incredibly happy. Like it doesn't look that much different, but I got a little trim. She's freshened up, she looks good. And now I'm going to ruin it all by putting on a hat. Now if you can't tell from the title of this video and what I am wearing today, I am doing the Walt Disney World tag in honor of me booking my next Disney World trip for the first time all by myself. I am very proud of me. I saw another Disney World tag that was like 30 questions about Disney World and you can only answer them within five minutes and um, we all know who I am here. I am not going to um, take like two seconds to answer a question. I'm going to take forever because I like to go um so yeah and then it takes me like an hour to edit 15 minutes of um footage without further ado let's jump into it shall we so what was the first time you went to disney world i was about three years old and i went with majority of my immediate family and i think a family friend as well i don't know exactly how long we stayed in the park i think it was maybe just a day we maybe visited magic kingdom or something this was back in like the late 90s so i don't even know what was like around or in disney world at this time i don't even know if they had hotels at this point maybe clearly i don't remember much from this trip i was about three years old so yeah what is your favorite park? It is a very close tie between Magic Kingdom and Epcot. I love Magic Kingdom because it is the park you think of when you think of Disney World or you hear Disney World in your head. You see Cinderella's Castle automatically. And it's just such a great staple of the park. It's magical. You know, because Magic Kingdom. <laughs> I'd say Epcot is a close second just because there is so much to look at through Epcot. You have the, the kind of like future world and then you have this other half of it where you just can explore the world and it is so incredibly cool. Favorite land in Magic Kingdom? Um, it's legitimately um, Main Street USA. <laughs> I know, I'm lame. I love Main Street USA so much because I love 1900s America. The architecture of all the buildings are just so beautiful. I love getting to watch the Dapper Dans. I love seeing, like, I think they have a dance show with the trolley or something, and I never, ever get to see that show. But I know the costumes they wear are just absolutely to die for. I just, oh, I love that era so much. Plus it's where you can get like all of your shopping done. So like, who doesn't love that? And Starbucks. 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 Favorite Disney Resort Hotel. I actually really love the Pop Century Resort. I think Pop Century is one of the really cool value resorts. If you love looking at things as much as I do, there is so much to look at. I even think they have kind of a pathway that you can take and it kind of, takes you throughout the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s. I think they have like these shadow boxes in the lobby of like keepsakes from the decade and it's just, it's really cool. I love Pop Century. Favorite snack? Me. <laughs> My favorite snack is one that you find in the hotels. It's these chips with character and they're so good. They're like the, like, non-gmo vegan gluten-free whatever and i think they have like two flavors and they are so delicious if i have to choose a snack that's in the park though i'd have to say dole whip i would love me some dole whip favorite souvenir i get a pair of mouse ears every time i go i know when we went during the 50th anniversary of disneyland that was also being celebrated at disney world i got a pair of the golden mickey ears on my first trip with my boyfriend i got a pair of the cap mini mouse ears i don't know where those are right now and then on our second trip together i got um, a pair of alice in wonderland ears i just love the cap ones so much i'm so glad they have like the little band on it now my gold ones don't have that. And then this last trip, I switched it up, got a little extra, and got some rose gold ears. I've never had a pair of the headband ears, and I figured I'd at least try them out. They give me like the biggest headaches on the entire planet, but I still love them. Favorite table service and counter service. My favorite table service is Tapenado at the Japan Pavilion at Epcot. 
and it is so good. Our last trip was the first time I went and it was the first time I was even like ever at a hibachi grill and all of it was absolutely amazing. If you have the chance to go to Teppanito, do it. My favorite quick service or counter service is actually Be Our Guest. I've done dinner service there before and I definitely think that's an experience that you should definitely try out once, but honestly, their counter service for lunch is my favorite. They have a sandwich for lunch service that is like the best. It's like turkey and arugula and some other stuff and I like, I'm obsessed with that sandwich. I get it every time we go there. I am so dead serious. Favorite show. It is Fantasmic. I am the biggest Fantasmic fan you will ever meet. I just watched the um, Disneyland update to Fantasmic and it's amazing. But part of me hopes they never change it at Disney World because it is so outdated and I just love it so much. I mean, I won't be upset if it like gets changed, but like I'll always have YouTube videos to watch of it. Favorite parade or fireworks? I, um, I don't like watching parades. I don't know why I don't like watching parades. It's really bizarre. I just... They don't intrigue me. But I will say my favorite fireworks are Happily Ever After. I love that they emphasized the point of Happily Ever After doesn't have to mean something romantic. It can be whatever you want it to be. And I love that they didn't focus on that aspect of it because we all think of Happily Ever After and we think of like Cinderella and Prince Charming or Sleeping Beauty and Prince Phil, you know? It just like, it is so, so good. I. Yeah, which is always has a very special place in my heart, but Happily Ever After is stunning and amazing. Favorite pavilion in Epcot? The Japan Pavilion, by far. They have like the best shopping, they have Teppanado, they have the drums playing. It's, it's, it's one of my favorite ones to go to. What color is your magic band? I have a yellow magic band. Favorite character to meet? Alice, for sure. I loved meeting Alice. She talked nonstop. I didn't even have to like say anything when I was meeting her. It is a fun and wonderful time. I look like Dopey right now. What? A character you haven't met but really want to. Minnie Mouse! And your best Disney memory. I might have to save that for a next video. I will give you a sneak peek. It does involve when I first met Alice and my Alice soon soon. But that's all I got for you. All right, I'll see you later. Bye.